What's up guys? So, we got a versus challenge today. I got uh, an O2 Chevy Avalanche. Got a tune up we're doing on it. It's gonna be JRC 54 versus Lauren. And what we got, we're each gonna have a separate bank, four spark plugs a piece, and we got We got all the same, uh, we got to get the, all the same tools. We got to get the tune-up done. We got to get the spark plugs out, the wires out, see who wins first. And we each get a three inch extension, a little one inch extension, and a ratchet with a spark plug socket. And then she's got the same. She's got a little three inch, little one inch or one and a half inch and the spark plug socket. She got the better ratchet, I believe. So, a little bit of an advantage. She gets the, the ladder, the stepping ladder, because she's short. Um, what else? I pulled one of her spark plug wires off already. So, I'm just trying to, uh, I'm just trying to list her advantages, just in case she wins. I got an excuse to, uh, you know, to pout about it. But, uh, rules are, there are no rules. We're gonna get the cat tripod set up right here, maybe in this area. Maybe get you guys kind of right here. She's got that side, I got this side. My side, obviously got the steering sh shaft in there. You can see blocking number three a little bit. You don't need to disconnect it on these avalanche. You got enough room there, but hey, any excuse right now counts for me. And then uh, another advantage of her, my fancy uh, flood hood light that I like to use is, is on her side more. So that counts as an excuse. So she gets better lighting on her side. Um, we're waiting on the wires to show up. Once these AC Delco wires show up, we're gonna get everything split up, get you guys set up. We're gonna start it up. Team JRC54 or team his better half? Leave in the comments who you would like to win. Catch you guys in a minute. guys I got you guys set up we each got our wires laid out and all greased up ready to go mine are over here like I said we pulled one of her wires already fight maybe I should tackle her <laughs> all right I think I'm gonna start off with a little three inch oh I got the wrong
you got the easy side. <laughs> at least I did. No, I forgot where I was. Sorry. Are all your wires off ready? Yeah. Oh, they were really in there. Now this is the one where the steering shaft's in the way. I got mine all out. She looks like she's on her last one there. I always like to peek at the gaps on these. They're platinum, so you ain't got to really worry about gapping them. They come pre-gapped. Just make sure they're not cracked or been dropped or anything like that. Oh, where's my rubber piece? I got to gotta do this without the rubber piece. I probably stuck that spark cord. Take your time. I think it rolled to the back of the truck at all. I'll just get another one on this one. Okay, got all mine up. Ready to firm it. Let's do this. Slow and steady. Guys, I had to get a new rubber piece. The last one's probably stuck on the spark plug that I dropped. This don't really fit that well. What number do you want? Three. Putting them in? Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> she's got a little bit of advantage on me, guys. <laughs> that rubber piece slowed me down. Right. I gotta get on this last one back in the leg of the tight. I should have grabbed her spark plug and hit it. <laughs> Are you making sure they're tight? I didn't start tightening them yet, but oh, okay, I'm putting good. them all the way almost with fingers. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. Okay, this 
she's using a little bit of a strategy. She's getting them finger tight in there first, and then she can go back and tighten them. I'm putting them in there and, and tighten them up all the way. I'm only on number two, but she's on number four though. So we'll see. And my socket keeps getting stuck on there because that rubber piece was oh like kind of newer. Oh, I can't find it. Yeah, it's good. Look at me, Bosh. Come on, Lauren. It's right there. Shit. Now this one. This one. And I can't see down here either. I, can't, I know. I can't yeah, you got all the light by you. Getting tense down the wire. You could you could cut the tension with a knife. I'm hoping her phone rings or something like that, so she has to stop. Because if my phone rings, I ain't answering it. Finish her! Done. No! Yeah! Woo! What do you got left? Two. Just two. Blue. Beat her by two wires, guys! Boom! Yes! <laughs> Excellent. You took one of my wires. Go ahead, we'll pan it out. Go ahead, we'll you, see how long it takes. You took one of my wires. I'm telling you. I don't know. The, hey, it's got to not be cracked, though, and you got to be on here. So you know what? We'll start it up. If my side's got a miss I, misfire, automatic disqualification. Same with her side. Okay. We'll add. We'll add three minutes. What about the other one? Hold up. Where's my other one? 
You gotta make sure that those are pushed out there. Did you take one of mine? The metal thing's up there. Oh, there. That's the wire I helped you off with. Yeah, and then you hit it on me, so yeah. <laughs> Thank you. You just gotta make sure that these are pushed down because this is all. Uh... Yeah, I'll double check. Okay. There's Lauren wrapping it up. Okay. Done. 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 Time. So getting ready to do the outro. A little bit of friendly competition. Uh, I won. Hopefully she don't make me sleep on the couch tonight for beating her on the spark plug roulette or whatever you want to call it. But. She's getting better, she's getting faster. We've done that a few other times. She's, on, she's got me a couple times, she's almost gotten me, but you can see that those spark plugs been in there for a long time. I mean, they were, they were pretty rough, creaking, and I thought one, one of mine, I thought were gonna break, but just a quick one, a little bit of fun uh, competition here at the Auto Shop Life. Let me know what you guys think. Leave a comment down below. Follow me on Instagram at caspertech54. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Signing out.